that one's Heather Max Smith. Hey guys. I'm Bob. I'm Barb. Together we make up Tennis World. But today the shoot is all about toilets. How comfortable is it and how much junk can you fit in that toilet? Yuck. <laughs> Today we're at the Florida RV Super Show and we thought we would talk about RV toilets. That's right. But not every toilet is right for you. You have to do your research and find out what toilet from small to large to long to wide will fit you comfortably. How much will fit in there? Some campers have uh, what they call kind of like a wet toilet, which you have your toilet and shower in one. And we are in a Lance camper, so it's giving you kind of um, kind of an idea of what it's like. But the toilet here, as you can see, is a round bowl. So there's all kinds of RV toilets. One is a wet bath. Does that work for you, Barb? Uh, no, I don't go for a shower. It's too moist in there. Not something that I'm interested in doing. Yee. Um, it's it's as you can see, it's the toilet, it's the shower. They even got the toilet paper in a little supposedly waterproof lid thing, but I don't know. I take long hot showers, so everything would be moist, and I would not enjoy that at all. Yeah, she does not take a GI shower for sure, so <laughs> that would be no. not good. <laughs> so Bob, tell me what you think about this toilet. Well, I'll give you the I'll give you the seat test. Oh, with the backpack on. It's just a little, um, little snug. I'm not, I'm not a big guy, but I'm, I like my elongated toilet, and we'll show you one later. He doesn't like and it being snug why. like a bug in a rug. Yeah, I like to be able to fit in there and feel comfortable. <laughs> what you gonna do with all that junk? All that junk inside that truck. What's this has got a real fancy <laughs> closet for your toilet, but not a fancy toilet. <laughs> Man, couldn't you put an oblong, elongated toilet in here? Let's look at this toilet here and let's talk a little bit about it. So this toilet is not an elongated toilet, right? It is a round toilet. It's a round toilet. So it seems to be kind of a fat round toilet. So does a fat round toilet work for you? Uh, because it's not small, it's it's a wide, does a junk fit in? these yeah. kind of toilets yeah but it's not my preferred toilet when we get to an elongated toilet we'll explain why we prefer it so we don't like the small round toilets because the junk don't fit the extra wide round toilets could possibly work <laughs> but the elongated is going to be where it's at and we're going to show you why in a few minutes giving you the illusion of elongated well it's definitely not around but man could you get any cheaper lid on there? Yeah, plastic. Plastic. Can you this? Yeah, the stains that you can't get out, the unmentionables. Yeah, that's that's cheesy. Here's our toilets. We got we got the roundy. Yeah, no junk, no junk inside that trunk. It does have a soft close yeah. or wooden elongated. Bob's favorite. All that junk inside that trunk. All that junk inside that trunk. You can't beat trunk. that long gated <laughs> toilet. <laughs> so thank you so much, Dometi, for giving us our toilet ending discussion. That's our exact toilet. Yeah. 320. So Bob, we've had this show of the different types of RVs that you typically find at the Florida RV Super Show. Right now I'm in my comfort zone. I'm at home and I got my nice long gated toilet. So Bob, why is the elongated toilet important to you? Because all the junk fits in the toilet. That's right. And then what's it's comfortable. And then you add an accessory that makes it even better. What is the accessory that you well, add? Well, we got a sprayer for in case we need some additional water. I don't need to explain that. <laughs> and, and this is not a bodet. No, it's this is not. not a bodet. We're not in Europe. This <laughs> is for 
additional cleanup. It is important in RV parks because a lot of times the water is not very strong. Yeah, and sometimes you're lucky to get 30 PSI. Yep, so. and when you try to flush it, you're like, mm, sometimes this is not working right. So this little bit of extra water you shoot in there and it's a little bit of power. So we just thought we'd have some fun with different types of toilets and how they work for you. So I, as a woman, also like this toilet. It's comfortable. I feel relaxed. It Everything works out just fine while we're in here. Yep. It's one of the best rooms in the RV. So not that this toilet is right for everyone. It's right for us. You guys need to find out what's right for you. Like, subscribe. Give us your comments. Let us know. Do you like round toilets or do you like long or elongated toilets <laughs> elongated smash up that notification bell because you never know when we're going to have something else coming out that could be like this or maybe even worse so remember we're ahead of the world come travel in our incredible world Bye.